question four. Now, Denise needs to have uh, three people's working working in the reception team at all times. So here we go. We've got time across the bottom. These are all the various people. So this is so basically between twelve and one o'clock. Can you see we got Rory, Jill, and Arak working? Or over here, for example, between seven and eight, we've got Jill, Arak, and Tamas working. So we need to slot Marta in, so she's covering to always make three people. So let's have a look. We've got three people here. We've got three people here. We've got three people here for the first half an hour. But from 2.30 onwards, we need Marta to start working. She's got to come in here. So she's making up the third person here, the third person here, the third person here. And she then needs to work until 18.30 because after that we've got three people working. So basically Marta's got to come in between 14.30 and 16.30. Now for part B, uh, Dev and Jane want to book a room for the hotel. Four nights in the exclusive double room. Well the exclusive double room is 275.95 per night for both of them. And then dinner is £25 per person. And uh, they want to book dinner for both of them for the four nights. So has Dev got enough money? Well, let's think about the room first of all. This is the cost of the room per night. So for four nights, we're going to have to do four lots of that. Four times 275.95 is that. Now for dinner, be careful. It's um, £25 per person. So each night, you're going to have to pay two lots of that because there's both Dev and Jane. So two people, four nights, that's going to be eight meals in total. So eight lots of £25, which is 200 So add the cost of the room to the cost of the dinner. We get this, 1303.80. Now Dev's only got £1,200, so Dev does not have enough money.